The mood inside this arena has definitely taken a turn, guys. Yeah, and I don't like it. Somebody turn the lights on. this night. I don't know. Part of me hoped Saxon would have got lost on the way to the announce table. That definitely would have made things better. But no such luck. one lives up to the hype, Byron. We're in for an amazing Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. The last time I heard San Antonio this loud was when we were last here for the Royal Rumble. He slips out. Wow, looked to me like he had it locked in pretty good. 
I guess not. What do you think about Bray Wyatt? What does he need to do to make sure his team comes out on top here? As you know, we're talking about somebody with a ton of talent. I'm not so sure I like the idea of it being showcased in a tag team. You gotta let talent like that shine on its own. Check out Bobby Roode's offense. Here it comes, he's got him. I don't think he should get up. Perfectly executed. And now he goes for it a second time. There may not be a more heartless individual than Bray Wyatt. When the lights go out and the Eater of Worlds stands in front of us, we're almost guaranteed to witness a gruesome scene. He's starting to stagger a bit. And you have to assume his partner is just itching to get in there right about now. It looks to me like his partner's itching to get in there. And now might be a good time to give him what he wants. Perhaps he has dinner plans to get to. I don't know. There has to be some reason for him showing next to no offense here tonight. Bray Wyatt has nothing but cruel intentions and no absence of malice. Bray Wyatt looks to eviscerate anyone who does not follow him. Everyone in the WWE locker room in the WWE Universe knows that. Bray Wyatt can hold millions of people around the world in the palm of his hand, and that's what makes him such a harrowing figure. Here's Chad Gable in position now. Look at Chad Gable here. We're gonna make the tag here. Attack at this point can change the whole complexion of this match, Michael. On, he lands right on the small of his back. Strowman fans with some reason to worry about here. Heading into this match, he and his partner look extremely confident. Well, it's not dire consequences for him here, which is good. But just in case, he might want to think about getting his partner in there for a bit. Oh, he's almost... There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. That one was packed with plenty of malice. There's a drop kick. Nice move. Whoa, missed by a large margin there. Come on, how do you miss by that much? And he drops the big leg. Doesn't show any signs of getting up here, guys. No, he's taking one heck of a beating, Michael. Second time we're seeing this here. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in it. Look at this! Ain't no stopping him now. Ray Wyatt. What does Bray Wyatt have to do at this point to stay in the match? His hopes of winning this tag team match are starting to dwindle. Chad Gable scores with a tremendous move. Nobody does it quite like him. Chad Gable doing a great job of turning that around. Ill-advised move. Really needs to get to the corner and make a tag. Oh, and he makes the tag. That was a game changer right there, Michael. The rep might have to check him after that neck breaker. Ray Wyatt reverses it. A brutal clothesline catches in the perfect spot. And Byron, he's still down after that one. Yeah, that did some big time damage, Michael. Braun Strowman is a force within the ring. He clearly did his homework heading into tonight. <laughs> oh, 
And I'm not sure Bray Wyatt should be playing to the crowd right here. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Left side. Through with an earth-shattering spine buster. That was glorious. That was simply amazing. Braun Strowman doing a great job of turning that around. If I was Chad Gable, I'd be careful not to get too flamboyant too early. Looking for the finish. Wow, I thought he was a goner. Oh, he turns it around. Oh, man. With the tag is Chad Gable. Not sure if he can sustain this, but it's sure fun to watch right now. He's not looking good here, Byron. No, he's got to get up, and he's got to get up now. Incredible! Look out, Braun Strowman is measuring. His shoulders are down. A kick out at two and a half. Nice kick out. And what a reversal from Chad Gable. Braun Strowman is taking a beating, and he could be out at any moment now. He needs to find a way to create some space. Counter here. Chad Gable is being outworked here tonight. Where do you think he should go from here? This tag team match is dangerously close to getting out of control for him. Why he's still in the match at this point is beyond me, guys. Maybe he forgot it's a tag team match. I don't know. There's got to be some explanation. Guys, at this point, I'd be shocked if his opponent is able to complete this comeback. That'll change his posture in a hurry. And he hits a monstrous powerbomb. Pushing forward. Oh, and he's still down, Byron. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. Things have gotten worse for Bray Wyatt. This is not where he wants to be at this point in this tag team match. I think he's shocked that his finisher didn't end it earlier. He hasn't really been himself since then. Clearly, they're both running on fumes right now. And at this point, it might just be a matter of which superstar's tank reaches empty first. Now, that's an impressive tag team victory. Here are your winners, Bobby Roode and Chad Gable. And the first match of the night comes to an end in thrilling fashion. I knew these two were a great team. I just didn't know how great. Wow, they really impressed me.